How are we doing, SMP family? Hope you're all good. Um, haven't spoken to the camera this year, and I definitely haven't um, done a YouTube video this year. I haven't done a YouTube video for a while now. So um, excuse the quality of this video. Uh, just something I wanted to put together quickly um, to discuss a topic that uh, a lot of people are asking me about recently. And that is someone in the public eye who has SMP, uh, and it's Chris Eubank Jr. Um, obviously quite a big name in the boxing world. Uh, he's got a big fight coming up this weekend against Liam Smith. But yeah, a lot of guys are asking me recently, do you think uh, Chris Eubanks had um, SMP? And yes, the answer is um, absolutely. I, I noticed years ago that he'd had, had SMP, even when he fought George Groves. I think that was like four or five years ago. Um, uh, you just find, I think if you're in this kind of world, you, you notice people's hair lying in the public eye um, and you know, you can, you can sort of suss these things out. So yeah, I'll post some pictures here of uh, the corner, like some corner footage from that fight. You can see his hair isn't quite short enough. Um, so that's going to prevent the SMP from ever really looking great. Um, but yeah, have a look at these. And so, yeah, you know, um, it's difficult to sort of see what kind of standard the SMP is from those pictures, um, especially because his hair isn't short enough, as I said. But um, what I've realised over the years from, from uh, you know, being a boxing fan and seeing him in different interviews and, and different fights, uh, the SMP has got progressively worse as he's had more and more done um, to the point where it now looks like this. Now, a lot of people will ask me, what do you think's happened? What do you think's gone wrong? Um, and, you know, there are a, there's a plethora of rookie mistakes there. Um, you can see how bold the front is, very, very saturated, overdone. It's, it's an amateur mistake to, to do the front as the darkest part. You can see how their treatment gets lighter back through the scalp when it should actually be the opposite. Um, the front should always be the most diffused part, even on a sort of strong, shaped up look. Um, yeah, I could go on. Um, but if you're in the market for SMP, do not let Chris Eubanks treatment put you off. If you go to someone experienced like myself, you know, I've got 10 years experience in this industry. Um, if you go to someone who knows what they're doing, you're not going to end up with something like that that's going to age like a regular tattoo. Done correctly. SMP is going to age subtly and softly, as you can see with mine. You know, still looking really very natural, hasn't discolored, and that's that's a depth issue. The discoloration that you see, uh, as it as it you can see, it looks like a regular tattoo. You know, this again is ten years old. This is what a ten year old regular tattoo looks like, and you're not going to get that in SMP if you go to the right person. So yeah, don't let it put you off. Chris, come and see your boy. I'll sort you out. We can laser it, we can uh, redo it, get you a nice, soft, natural looking SMP treatment. But yeah, until next time, I'm gonna be doing more videos by the way, so uh, subscribe to the channel and speak to you soon.